Darren Chris hey. is with us. You guys all got to know him on the hit show Glee. Now he's playing a very different role in American Crime Stories, The Assassination of Johnny Versace. Congratulations on this. Thank Just you. watched it. Oh, man. Thank you. It's a wild ride. It is. Um, you play Andrew Kananen, the man who murdered Versace back in 1997 when you were 10 years old yeah. in real life. So what did you know about this story? How much research did you do? And what was your reaction to the story? Um, I knew about as much as I think most people tuning in uh, know about it. Uh, I think uh, m whether or not you're in fashion or anything, I think in s as far as so, um, cultural knowledge, people know that Johnny was unfortunately murdered at the steps of his home uh, in the late 90s. Uh, I vaguely remember knowing that it was a, a young man yeah. who was half Filipino, which was interesting to me as a half Filipino kid. So that was uh, that was about it. So uh, that's the, just the tip of the iceberg. I mean, we have nine episodes to cover something that, you know, the assassination of Johnny Versace happens within the first several minutes of our show, and then we have nine episodes. So there's a lot more going on. It's than really I think interesting understand. the way he put it together. Yeah. I don't want to give too much away. Um, the series creator Ryan Murphy. Um, is also the creator of Glee. Um, he said, um, you might know this, you were his first and only choice for this role. And he also said that he knew you were capable of great darkness. Well, because I'm a dark dude. <laughs> Can't you tell? I'm, I'm such an insidious <laughs> presence. Uh, no, uh, I mean, I, I appreciate that. I think that's more of him, uh, him giving me a vote of confidence as an actor than, uh, than a judgment of, of, of me being a, uh, a, a sullen person, yes. I should hope. But uh, no, I appreciate his, his faith in me. I mean, you know, I, I joke about this, and I don't mean this with any indignant. Uh, I'm not trying to be indignant, but actors act. Like, mm -hmm. we're actors. Uh, and so hopefully we are capable of great of darkness, of great light. That is the sort of nature of our job. Yep. So um, I'm glad that he uh, that he noticed. To do it. I'm glad that he noticed. Yes, yes. yes. And I hope uh, that I was up that I was up to, to par. And, and you're and you're surrounded by other actors who really know how to do their craft. Penelope Cruz, uh, Edgar oh, Ramirez as Versace yeah. is 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 blew us away. I mean, we've got some good actors on this show. What yeah. can I say? It's, it was a, it was like playing with the big leagues. I feel like I really made varsity being around all these incredible folks. And so, how about uh, Ricky Martin? Ricky, Ricky Martin. Martin. Yeah, let's not in, forget in a, how good an amazing actor he is. Role, yeah. And I understand that there were some perks to working with Ricky. He would have you over to his house in Miami for yeah. major for major sing-alongs. Uh, yeah, in, in Los Angeles, he was very kind to have us all kind of get together and have uh, time because we I I wouldn't spend any time with them on set. So uh, yeah, we had some fun. I, it, it, if I go to someone's house and it's Ricky Martin's house, I'm going to bring my guitar and yes. find an excuse to play Live in the Vita Loca <laughs> with Ricky Martin because life's too short. Yes. i got to check that one off my bucket list. Thank and you. And yeah, I did, by the way. <laughs> I did. It's great. Yeah. And he liked? Oh, yeah, he did. Okay. He's cool. He, all right. he's, he's all about, I think he's okay with the fact that guys like me go, you're Ricky Martin. He goes, yes, I am. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Uh, <laughs> but we liked, we loved this. I want to let make sure everybody knows, you said nine episodes. Yes, yes. Everybody, the assassination of Johnny Versace premieres Wednesday night on FX. Do not miss it. Thank you so much Thank for you visiting so much. us. Thank you.